Later on in the winter, you mentioned dust mites, so let's talk about dust mites okay. a little bit and why they're so important. Dust mites are very important, especially in this part of the country. They're tiny little mites that live in uh, upholstered furniture, mattresses, pillows. So that's going to be a big problem in our bedrooms. We spend about a third of our day in our bedrooms and you're just lying there exposed to this all night long. The little mites, there's millions of them in your mattress. How many? At least 10 million in your mattress. How about the pillow? At least a million in your pillow. Wow, do they crawl around? Do they get up, do they crawl on your skin? You can't see them, so they're microscopic, uh, but they do, what actually causes a lot of problems is they put out little fecal pellets and each of the little mites puts out anywhere from up to 30 fecal pellets a day and we breathe these things in and for people who are allergic that causes a problem. Wow, so the, pillow, the pillows are loaded with dust mite fecal droplets and so are the mattresses. Mm -hmm. So if you lay down on your pillow and you're not allergic, does that bother you? If you're not allergic, it doesn't tend to cause as many problems. If you lay down on your pillow and you breathe in, and you're allergic to dust and you breathe in dust mite droplets, what's that like? It absolutely causes problems. And a lot of patients with dust mite allergy will notice a lot of morning symptoms. So they wake up in the morning with stuffy nose. And for patients with asthma, that might be the worst time for them is when they go to sleep. They breathe this in and they wake up with coughing and wheezing. So people really don't have a chance, it seems like. It's hard. 